So for our next release for VS Code XML, we're going to be bringing DTD support. And uh, to start off, uh, if we have a DTD file, we allow the ability to format the document. So if you do that, you'll get a formatted DTD document. Um, another feature we have is completion. So here it can complete um, a DTD element in this case. Um, also, there is validation. So if it is general, some syntax validation here to let you know that the it's not terminated with the bracket. So similarly, in a XML file, you can have DTD content within it. So if you were to format, um, if you were to format a doc, an XML document with DTD before it would break and it would lose all the DTD content but now it's handled here and it's all format nicely. And here it does DTD validation uh, against this content here, and it'll give you error messages. Um, another feature we have is outlines. So if we go back to the DTD file, um, here you'll get the entire outline of all your content and it'll show you for each uh, node, um, give you some information about it and here, if we look at product, it recognizes that it's connected to this node here and it sets it as a child. Uh, for this release, this is the biggest thing we've done, but then there's other small fixes and just for uh, s small improvements to the rest of the XML extension, as well as uh, some parts to XML features themselves. And that's it.